last of them. Hopefully this is the only place. Was that a door opening? Are they still here? Be careful. We know they're armed. What the hell is that noise? Alrighty, hello and welcome to the channel, and for today's video, we're back in Hunter Call of the Wild, continuing the missions, finally. And a glorious thing has occurred. My audio might sound a wee bit different, and that's because, holy heck, after four months of waiting, my GoXLR Mini has finally come in. I have spent the last, uh, three days now, yeah, uh, two days working on it, because of course their servers would go down the day I got it, so... Putting software in was actually kind of difficult. Required some emails and locating of it to find it up somewhere other than their website. And uh, yeah, and then I actually have already done a recording, but this is going to come out before that recording because I record things out of order because I'm weird like that. Now, that being said, back to the point of the hand, which is missions. And uh, if I remember correctly, we oh, find the source of the scream. Investigate the area where Baden dropped her phone. So we have to find the source of a scream in the woods. This ought to end well. What time is it? Okay, it's midday. We're doing good. Oh, jeez. What do we got? <laughs> Am I really going to have a need zone right in the middle of a freaking road here? Pretty much. Oh, hey, and there's a turkey. Okay. Perspective was off, right? Because... Otherwise, that turkey would have been the same size as that mule deer. So it's either a tiny mule deer or... Wait. You are not a four. What? There's a big old four right there? Oh, there you are, buddy. I'll take you. Come on. Go ahead and turn broadside. I'm really hoping this guy wants to turn. Ah. That, that's... Sitting there holding my breath, trying to pass myself out. All right, now he's he's pretty much gone, but that was interesting. Now, of course, that's a little cheaty, because the only reason I even knew he was there was because the little uh, E popped up. Again, I kind of wish I could get rid of that, because I could not see him through the grass. That was, wait, oh, they're continuing to travel, right? Yeah, they're continuing to go. Okay. Was this zone up? I was about to be. Oh, well. Moving on. I'm sure I don't need to remind you, this is bear country. Sure, they're normally quick to turn tail and run, but they're extremely aggressive if their cubs are nearby. It's time for maximum caution. Maximum caution engaged. Really wishing cubs were actually a thing, because I don't think I've ever seen an infant animal of any sort in this. That sounds like a bad old... No, I was thinking Maximum Destruction. I was gonna say, it sounds like a bad old movie, but... Oh, okay, Maximum Destru Destruction was not a bad movie. It... I should... B-movie? An old B-movie? Hang on a second. The hell am I here? Okay, I... Again, I just stated that I have new audio equipment. So I was like, why am I getting sudden line noise? That's not what I'm hearing. Is that an air horn? Like one of those old party air horns? What the... Okay, hang on a second. There are bear tracks. I don't have tracks turned on. I do not. Alright, we're just walking. Cause something's going on over here. What the hell was that? Man, those rams make some goofy noises compared to, like, uh, the mouflin. Yeah. It's like a horn or something. No shit. Can you hear that? It's like a horn or something. You kidding me, right? Am I supposed to believe that that iPhone or actually that looks more like an old Android cuz of the thing. That's making this noise. An air horn app. 
I've heard of people trying to scare away bears and cougars with real-life air horns. Personally, I've never really trusted using sound to scare off a bear. Not permanently, at least. Well, that's the contact number I had for her. Cell phone service can be really poor out there, though. Still, she was here. Check out the bear markings on that tree. Am I am I supposed to see something? Let's see what we got here. Oh, those are boot prints. That makes sense. Those look like fresh footprints. She made it out of there, heading west. Still, now she has no phone and no water bottle. Let me look at the map and I'll come up with a game plan. Maybe start with tracking the animal? Go we'll figure out where this homo sapien went after trying to use an android to scare off a bear or something. It's a nice lake, by the way. Lots of, lots of stuff here. Bear spray. Okay. Looks like someone forgot their bear deterrent. Mind you, if you're caught unaware, it might not help. I'll never forget the time I was hunting elk with a group of friends, and a 1,200-pound grizzly came in hot from 30 yards out. Some of us had bear spray, but the wind was too strong to use it. The only reason we made it out alive is because the bear got confused when all six of us split up. It was like something out of a movie. Instead, it's a video game. Okay. Investigate the area where Baden dropped her phone. Okay, I was supposed to check a tree over here that had markings, I think. So I'm not going to lie, I'm starting to think that the problem is is that whatever this, there's probably a bear track I'm supposed to investigate. And I haven't found it because the ground has been so traveled by the rams and the mule deer that without track uh, effects and whatnot on to aid in the visual, I'm just not seeing it. So you know what? Just for this, let's see if I'm right. Uh... Wait. What? There's no sign of her, is there? If she tried to hide from a bear up a tree, she found out pretty fast that bears are great climbers. Maybe she threw the water bottle in her phone to give herself a chance to escape. Are there any more clues? A bear. Be careful. What? All right, hang on. What What bear? Oh, because now I was supposed to interact with that that I couldn't see, then come down here find the bear repellent. I did this out of order, so I may have broken the mission. Let's see. And then I guess I'm supposed to see a bear? Okay, got it. Not far from where you are, we have the old funicular railway. It's pretty big. And it's a tourist attraction. If Baden sees it, then maybe she'll head towards it to look for help. At the bottom of the track, there's an old shed that she could try to shelter close to. It's not much, but it's a start. Given how badly things have gone for her so far, I can only hope that she's not still planning to climb a mountain. I'm going to give the accountants another call at the hospital. See if they can't help us work out where her head is at. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, quick question. You said a bear. Look out. Where bear? Bear where? Who bear? Bear dare? Bear care? Care bear? No bear. Okay, then. Uh, so now where am I headed? Oh, bloody hell. Of course I need a head. Oh, boy. Okay, so... Forget the bear that I didn't see. I'm gonna head to the base of the cave. So that was interesting. So apparently... I I'm confused. What marking is on this tree that wasn't there before? I I didn't see a marking. So I guess I was just supposed to stand in the right spot till the E came on. I did eventually. But now I need to head... I'm still going the wrong way. I need to... Okay. Just... I'm, I'm going to head to the road where I already know the road is, just to be on the safe side. And I guess I'm going to head over to... What did he say this was? It's a trail. Yeah. I'm going to head to a trail. Woohoo! And keep a lookout on for the infamous bear. I missed my turn, son of a biscuit. Well, that's a, uh... That's a trail, isn't it? Alrighty, I think I'm getting up on where I'm supposed to be. Supposedly this trail ends right up here. And then what I'm looking for is to the left. 
Oh, there's a building over there. Hopefully that's also an outpost. Because it is getting late in the day and I don't really want to be wandering around here at night. No. But it's something. What the hell has happened here? It looks like the bears have been using the shed as a latrine and a scratching post. I'm meant to be taking a potential investor to tour the reserve this week. She cannot see this. Baden's not here. There's no sign of her. And I still can't get through to the accountants. They've left the hospital and don't have their cell phones. Can you put the shed back together and tidy things up a bit? I hate to do this, but there's no way I'm going to make it out there before the tour. It might be from a bear, but why would they come here? I, uh, okay, ha hang on a second. Let, let's see if I have this straight before we get to that. We have a lady who got a bunch of people sick, eating random stuff in the woods. They've gone to the hospital, left the hospital. I uh, have their cell phones because I was the one to pick them up from the tent. The lady is now lost, potentially being stalked by a bear. We have somehow stumbled across the bear's decided new kennel. Uh, there's an old man still on the loose, by the way, who disappeared after mourning the death of his wife. And one of your friends or old acquaintances is lost after discovering what he believes to be a government conspiracy to keep an old mine up and running. And you want me to stop to play Fix-It Felix and try and put the door back on and all this stuff? I, I Start not to make sense. Okay, wait a second. Can I, uh... I don't see bears tearing that off. Thanks. It's probably still going to smell pretty bad, but at least it's not covered in bear scat. Bears tend to stay away from humans, and we never kept anything that would attract them inside that shed. Are there any tracks nearby? The place looked fine when I was here last week. That's weird. So... A vertical tracking on animal calls always amuses me, because, like, right there. So there's a valley over there, I guess, and the animal's down in the valley. But for some reason, I can see it through the hillside. All right, so... That's unexpected. The public don't tend to drive to the funicular. And if it was one of the staff, they'd use quad bikes. This looks like it was left by a car or a truck. What? I think someone has vandalized our property. It doesn't make a lot of sense, though. Why would anyone come all the way out here to do this? Maybe bored teenagers? I pulled some stupid pranks when I was young, but none involved faring around a bunch of bear scat. Given that this has happened to the shed, I'm a little worried about the railway itself. It's a unique tourist site, over a hundred years old. It leads all the way up to Prosperity, the reserve's ghost town. It used to be home to the miners who came out here during the Silver Rush. I think it's a little creepy, but tourists like it. Would you check the track out, please? I would feel a lot better knowing it's okay. Well, there is a lookout post that way, which would lead me to believe that there must be an outpost. Okay, I don't know what tracks he's talking about, but apparently there were tracks. Okay, I guess we're hiking through the woods on the railroad track, and what are we doing now? Okay, we just got distracted. This guy, this guy has worse focusing capabilities than I do. Find this person potentially being eaten by a bear. Find this person potentially lost in a mine. Find this guy who decided to wander around without a weapon in bear country. Ooh, walk the track. Make sure it's not vandalized, please. What? What's going on with the rail? Well, if I'd have known it, I mean, that's, that's pretty broken. Uh, that, that doesn't happen easily up as in removed how did they even it's just been ripped out of the ground gone this would have taken a crew and equipment this isn't teenagers with too much time on their hands this is the sabotage of one of our irreplaceable attractions i need some pictures i'm gonna send them to the police oh i'm guessing i need to actually like i'm on hold with the sheriff's office then I think I need to call my dad. Since it appears that someone is trying to sabotage the reserve, I need you... Hello? Yes, Sheriff Cole, please. I need you to head up to the ghost town and see if they've done any damage there. I'll check in later. Jerry, hey, thanks for picking up so fast. All right, so as any uh, sane person would do... My God. Or, wait. 
Oh, is it just because these bits of track are missing? Okay, I was like, the, you look at these gaps. That's not, uh, that's not safe. I wouldn't want to send something up that. Um, but I'm going to have to take a whack that this is probably not going to be as fun as I might think it is. Uh, because we're going to send my paranoid self up a mountain to go check out an old haunted town. And it's going to be nightfall by the time we get there, so this will be absolutely wonderful. And I need to quit walking on the gap track. Okay, no. I I'm going to take a whack. They just left the gaps in there. Oh, and then we got some floating grass. Okay, so there's there's bigger issues at play here. Alright, so there's the lookout. I need to get to that. What is this, the end of the track? No, it's just a station along the way. Oh no, it is the end of the... Okay. Yeah, no, I hear you. Apparently I ran up on a mountain lion. You know what? I'm going to assume I spooked it. It's a horrible assumption to make in this case. But I'm going to make it. Alright, let's see. Uh, there's something to the... Okay, I got the lookout up there I need to get to. Is that actually up on a cliff? Yeah, okay. So, hmm. And then there's something across the ways I need to check out. So, I think first things first is I'm going to go ahead and hike it up this... Can I? Hmm. Maybe, maybe not. I will find a way up to the lookout, then figure out what's across the track, then make my way to the ghost town, all the meanwhile probably being ready to shoot a mountain lion in the face. What's that? Flowers. Okay, we're good. Ah, good. So the thing across the way is an outpost. Perfect. That's exactly what I was looking for. That's because he's headed back down the mountain somewhere. Oh. There he is. Where'd he go? There he is. There you are. Where are you gonna run, bud? Oh no. <laughs> uh, I don't see him. Oh, he's down. The question is, where? Oh, thank God, it's the elf. Oof. And I think I saved my mountain lion. Woohoo! Yay! Oh, body will. Whoa! Uh, I missed. Oh, well. What was it, a six heart? So she would have been just barely into gold. Still, a thousand bucks. I want to check out that cave before I get to the outpost. That's cool looking. Little creepy. Little creepy. What? Where, where, where did that come from? Is that from on top? Ah, well, I'm guessing we'll get to this. I can't even... What is all... Is that just the wall? Bit of a texture glitch there. Alright, well, I'm guessing that has to do with a mission I haven't gotten to yet. So, we will ignore this awesomeness right now for a second, and move on to the outpost, and then on to the ghost town, and stop getting sidetracked. As soon as I say that. there. I know, I hear that mountain line. I know what it is, too. That's a two minor. That's a three. Neither of them are really big, so I'm gonna let them be so not to build hunting pressure and also not to keep getting distracted. That's not a bad looking right there. I don't have anything that'll take that kind of range shot, so he gets to live. But, outpost. I mean, when we get done with the missions and it'll be time to go around and do some free hunting, there is, there's a lot to be had. Like that guy.
<laughs> the hills are alive with the sound of elk. I spoke with the sheriff. He's as confused as I am. But he's gonna send someone over to take a look. Let me know when you get to the ghost town. Okay. You know, I guess we never really do address. How are we communicating? Is this by cell phone? Um, 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 wait. Hey boss, I think we got a problem. Kinda makes me feel bad for getting that mountain lion a minute ago, huh? I've got a heavy feeling in the pit of my stomach. Oh, oh jeez, they're all over the place. Um... They've been here as well. Damn it! They've gone from vandals to poachers and mindless animal killers. This is escalating so quickly. Who would possibly want to do this? Some disgruntled former staff member? Uh, my dad and I haven't had any trouble with any of our staff, past or present. Can you take a look around? I want to know just how much damage these guys have done. If you find an animal, take a picture and send it my way, please. Wait. Okay. I'll save this for the police. Thanks. That's one. Two. Three. I'm just gonna throw this out there. If it were me in real life, I would have taken the rifle and cleared the buildings first because that right there, to me, is a sign that somebody hasn't left. And considering the number of dead mountain lions, uh, I would hesitate a very high level of caution. Hesitate a very high level. I would not even be able to word. I would be shooting. I'd probably put several rounds in the air just to see if I could rustle up some movement to see if they would give their positions away. But hey, that's just me. Uh, and there was one more over here, I think. I don't actually think I'm supposed to have to take pictures of all of them. Wasn't there one more over here? Oh, yeah, right there. Okay. End hunting now. Well, that's never a good sign. Okay, there's a tape recorder. Uh, but I'm having a graphical glitch. Are the fogs moving in? I don't have a damn clue. Okay, what am I supposed to be doing now? Photograph any animal carcasses you find. There, so there's still one left. Okay, I got those two. There's gotta be more like this way that I missed. I got you. Didn't I take, yeah, I took a photo of that one. The one in the road. I mean, there's gotta be people out here, right? I'm seeing gas cans all over the place. But I have yet to see a generator. Okay, so I took a photo of all these three. Took a photo of that one. There's one down there. There's that one there. Am I missing one? Wait. No, I got a photo of that one. Well, that's not good. The text is showing through the wall. There's a graphical glitch for you. Um, seems to me like I should just now be going in here. Maybe I, oh, you know what? Maybe I gotta take a photo of this. No, that, no. Maybe I didn't properly get photos of these. Oh, Jesus. I mean, he's not saying anything. What, what am I supposed to be doing now? There's a, I'm missing a carcass is the issue. Right? Photograph any animal carcasses you find. I must be missing one. All right, hang on. Let's see. Do they... Hmm. Down animal highlight. Oh, but I think I have to turn track effects on to also have that. No, these do not trigger as downed animals. Uh, I'm sorry. Did I just hear a bat? Not 100% sure I'm a fan of bats. Who didn't I take a photo of? Okay, there's a bag here. No? I mean, clearly that's... That's a remains bag? Or like a, a remains bag, a game bag. What the hell? I'm not gonna lie, I'm getting a little worried because what am I missing? Good work. Got it. What? Hang on a second. What's going on here? Can I do something with this now?
I, I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. It, I know I'm supposed to be photographing the bodies, but I have to be missing one, right? A third. What? Okay. Okay, it's counted three. Oh. What the hell's going on here? So, must it... Am I not getting the whole thing in the shot? Is that the issue here? So, if I just... I'm gonna fill up my hard drive with screenshots. This is ridiculous. Okay, well, now that I technically found the third, does that mean I can go to here? No. Do I take a photo of this now? No. Is it because I'm leaving the camera out? Oh, don't tell me I'm just stupid. Well, another one. That's cheat. How long did this take them? I wonder. Okay, so that was a third. That means I think it already counted those two, right? Oh my God, was I just being dumb about this? Uh oh, was I? And then there's one up here. So you have to go out of camera mode and back into trigger. I feel dumb because, oh my God, has that really been the issue this whole time? Let's see if this works. Oh. Okay, no. Wait, what am I supposed to do now? I'm continuing to photograph animal carcasses, but for some reason I'm not getting... I must be missing something? That was number four, because he said a third, right? So I got that one, that one. I must have gotten these two. Is that the last of them? Hopefully this is the only place... Was that a door opening? Are they still here? Be careful. We know they're armed. What the hell is that noise? Oh, it's a tape recorder. I totally forgot. Holy sh... What's that sound? It's horrible. End hunting now. What? Is this some kind of activist? I don't buy it. Those sounds... Like animals dying. Take a picture of the text and send it over. Oh. I know we hunt animals, but making a quick, clean kill is paramount for us. How the, the hell has this I'll happened? The others. How did we go from thinking this was kids being a nuisance to armed poachers killing and torturing animals? This was... something else. Needless cruelty. All to send us a message. The deputy sheriff is on her way over now. Listen, I don't think it's best for you to be chasing these people down now. They're armed, and they don't seem to care much for ethics or responsibility. I'd like you to get out of there, and the police will take over. Um, wait, but hang on. There is actually one place where it's hopefully safe to send you, where you might find something that can help us. These people seem to know exactly how to hurt us. They've targeted our unique tourist spots and our animals. There's a fossil excavation site that I was planning to show our investor as well. It's abandoned just now as the college ran out of funding for the dig last year, but we've been keeping it safe for when they come back. It's basically just a shed and a hole, but it represents a good opportunity to interact with the local community and college. Tourists don't go there but it's a big part of raising the reserve's profile in a way that doesn't involve hunting. Can you head over there and make sure everything is still locked up and secure? It's not good for our reputation if we can't protect a tiny dig site. Uh, and that would be north of us. It is not good for our reputation. I'm sorry. Okay, recap. Uh, hippie woman lost after hospitalizing a bunch of friends from eating random stuff, potentially being eaten by a bear, disappeared somewhere by some vandalized tracks by people who turned out to be hunters and or poachers and ended up killing, uh, what was that, four or five uh, mountain lions while leaving a voice recorder of dying animals in the shed, not to mention that bag that we actually can't look at. Uh, what else? Oh, bears are squatting in one of the uh, rail car things. There's an old man mourning his wife lost in the woods in bear country without a gun. And there is a, uh, I believe they would call him touched, man who believes a government conspiracy, the keeping a mine active, has also disappeared in the woods. It, meanwhile, haven't met a single friggin' person, even though, it, I, like, what the hell? 
<laughs> <laughs> I, honestly, whoever writes these, have they ever thought about going into television? Because honestly, this, to me, it's like, uh, I don't know. It, it's a few steps away from being something like Longmire or Justified. Actually, come to think, it wasn't there one where it was a game warden? It wasn't long, uh, it was like Longmire, but a game warden. I'm drawing a blank on the name, but I swear to God, there is a show. If not, there's going to be. Anyways, that's going to do for this one. Uh, I guess next time we're off to take up a dig site, and I'm going to go ahead and throw it out there. We're going to call this a foreshadowing based off previous events. The people will be missing, and we will never find them. Hey, how do you end these missions? It's going to be, I got a phone call. They made it home safe, or hey, they showed up here. Uh, these stories really could use NPCs. The bats, though. Not a fan of bats. Nope. Do you actually see him? Oh, no, I don't think you see him fly around. You just hear him. I mean, you could. A clear night like this. Anyway, so that's going to do it for this one. I got to go figure out. Wait, what is that? Oh, right. The lookout tower. Uh, yeah. Off to a dig site. So there are buttons if you liked it. Buttons if you didn't. And as always, buttons to push. Until next time. <laughs>